grit, growth, and then glory. I know ideally we want to have the substance without the struggle. We want the destiny without the disappointments. We want the vision without the giants and we want the comeback without the setback. We want the glory without the grit and the growth. But what we fail to comprehend is that what makes winning significant is the losses that we have to endure in the pursuit of what we desire, aspire, or conspire to create. Or let me say it a different way. Losing makes winning worth it. I mean, if there was no no, then yes would carry no weight. If your first business idea worked, then you'd be an overnight success. But next week's greatest tragedy. If you never knew a broken heart, you'd never know real love. And if you never experienced death, you never embrace the fragility of life. No grit, no growth, then no glory. I know we hate the pain, the turmoil, the rejection that we have to face. And we hate these things because we have a broken perspective about what it really means to be successful. You see, we equate success to accomplishments. Not realizing that true success is not just about what you accomplish, but who you become in the pursuit of your accomplishments. But here's the truth, whether you want to hear it or not. Freedom will cost you friendships. Your calling will cost you comfort. And success will cost you security. But listen to me closely, in this life, you'll never have substance without struggle. You'll never have destiny without disappointments. You'll never have vision without giants. And if you don't break, you'll never experience a breakthrough. No grit, no growth, then no glory. Thank you.